Hey guys, this is Mr. A Chrissy here. And in today's movie review, we're, 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 we're gonna be doing a movie review today on this very old Christmas film. This is actually a Christmas movie that came out a, a very long time ago, way back in like, way back between like 1946 and like 1947, but this is mostly a 1946 film. So, so it, it's a very old movie made, made by this company called Liberty Films that, that features like a, you know, the, like almost like a Liberty Bell. And so, and of course, it's also it's also an alt it's also a, a, a masterpiece. It's not only a Christmas masterpiece, but also a Christmas classic as well. I I know my mom doesn't I'm a, I'm a, I know my my mom doesn't really like this movie, but I mean I respect her her thoughts and opinions on this film, but I don't really care what anyone says. I think I think this the, I think this movie is an all time classic from to watch on Christmas, and even and NBC also airs this movie every sing every every single year when when Christmas comes like, and so. And so the, the 1946 movie I'm going to be reviewing today is going to be on It's a Wonderful Life. It's a, It's a Wonderful Life is a Christmas movie and it, it's a Christmas movie starring James Stewart. And so the story of It's a Wonderful Life is about this. It's about a guy named George Bailey who has who has so many problems he he is thinking about ending it all and it's Christmas. As the angels discuss George, we see his life in flashback. As George is about to jump from from a bridge, he he ends up he ends up rescuing his guardian angel Clarence, who then shows George what his town would would have would have looked like if if he hadn't been for if he hadn't been for all all his good deeds over the years. And of course, we all know we all know the line from "It's a Wonderful Life." Every time every time a bell rings, an angel an, an angel gets his wings. Yep. So, so that's so that's the story of "It's a Wonderful Life." So, what do I think of it? Honestly. I don't really care what my mom says, even though even though my mom doesn't really like this film. Like she calls this movie like the weirdest Christmas movie of all time. But I don't know if you guys have the same opinions as her. But 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 I, I've seen a lot of people. I've seen a lot of people on social media on the internet that, that it's like it, most of them pretty much love this movie because I gotta say it's a wonderful life. It's definitely it's definitely an all time Christmas classic from way back in like the forties, the like 1946 when this movie first came out. And and like I said, NBC usually airs this movie every single year. Yeah, during the, during the holidays and and I gotta say, it's a wonderful life. It's definitely one one of the best Christmas movies ever made, in my opinion. I will say it's definitely a great film, and definitely one of the best Christmas movies of all time. And and it's a wonderful life is also directed by this guy named um. The, the back of the DVD says it was produced and directed by Frank Cobra. Yeah, Capra. Yeah, whatever you want to pronounce that name. And this movie also stars Lionel Barrymore and. Yeah, Lionel Barrymore. Yeah, yeah, he's also in this film, and and yeah, and and of course, oh, oh yeah, it, it's a wonderful life. I almost forgot Donna Reed is also in this film too. So, and the acting itself, like the the acting itself, it, it, the, the acting itself is pretty good. Like I think I think James Stewart did, did a great job in this film. James Stewart, Donna Reed, and there's also Lionel Barrymore. Also, I also rec I also a long time ago I recognized this one actress who was in It's a Wonderful Life, and her name is like Lillian Randolph. Like Lillian Randolph actually plays Annie in It's a Wonderful Life, and 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 I know she's done some voice acting roles like on Mammy Two Shoes and some of the Tom and Jerry cartoons, like you know like where her face is not really shown and you know it's like you know you know she's like she's like one of the human characters like without without her face shown because you know <laughs> like you know, Lillian Randolph like. And 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 I thought she did good in this film. I I thought she did pretty good in It's a Wonderful Life, and and I, and I and I know she and I and I think she was pretty good as Mammy Two Shoes from Tom and Jerry as well. And of course, this DVD was also released by Paramount. Like the Paramount, like Paramount actually releases film on DVD. Like the the DVD I own is from Paramount. Oh yeah, because not only Liberty Films made it, like you know, but there's also like Republic Pictures also is also was also involved in this film too. Like Republic Pictures, I think it's the one with the eagle in the sky. I think, yeah. yeah, and and plus and plus and and and, and probably because since since this movie came out like a long time ago, back in like 1946, and the movie was shot in black and white. I mean. I think it says there's also I think it says that there's also a color version of the film, but but I I usually see the movie in black and white. Oh yeah, because the DVD here the DVD here also includes a, a a brand new color version as well as the the restored black and white version. 
And this movie's actually not rated. But if this movie did have a rating by by the Motion Picture Association of America, I would have assumed, I think, It's a Wonderful Life would have been PG rated or, I don't know, maybe G rated. I mean, it doesn't really matter because this movie could be for all ages or maybe or maybe it could be like maybe it could be like a PG rated film or something like that. But maybe PG-13 or something. I'm I'm just going to say PG. That's all. So here are the discs. This DVD also includes a documentary, which is like the, which is like a little behind the scenes documentary about the making of It's a Wonderful Life. Yeah, so, so overall, It's a Wonderful Life is 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 a Christmas classic from 1946, and I'm gonna give It's a Wonderful Life, um, I'm gonna give it four and a half out of five stars. So if you if you haven't seen It's a Wonderful Life yet, if you haven't watched it yet. Then I definitely recommend it. I, I I think it's one of the I think it's one of the best Christmas movies to watch during the holiday season. So there you have it, guys. That's gonna be it for my movie review on It's a Wonderful Life, and that's gonna be it for this video. So make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And as always, thanks for watching. And until next time, this is Mr. A Crazy saying goodbye, everybody, and that's about it.